Operation Lone Wolf underway. Truck's en route. What's the rush all of a sudden? Dr. Dominguez is here in Peru. Is that good enough for you? Hi, Commander. Sorry, sir. Those drones were unexpectedly heavy and sharp. Boat looks okay, though. I'm glad you're here. We have a problem. But Jenny again? I'm on. Very bad. Command, this is Dock Station. Operation Lone Wolf underway. Drones have been launched. They're five miles downriver. Signal is strong. I'll let you know if they find anything. Out. Yeah, there's a Trinity base here. Hey, Jonah, I... What happened here? I said don't break anything. Hey, Abby, I can explain. I'll get back to you later, Lara. Don't do anything crazy. sealing everything up because Commander Rourke said to hold the perimeter. No one goes in or out. I know that, smartass. But you know why? That's above my pay grade. When the recon team gets here, maybe they'll be able to tell us something. Borvenir, this is Commander Rourke. Have you achieved lockdown? We're almost there. All access points are covered, and most of the barricades are finished. Almost isn't good enough. Secure the perimeter now, and make damn sure it's locked tight. Aye, sir. Uh, if I could ask, sir, uh, what's going on? Recon team is en route. Work out. We shouldn't assume the worst. They might be okay. That recon team better get here soon. 
Shouldn't we send someone down to look for them? Rourke was explicit. No search and rescue until the recon team gets here. But it's almost been an hour since last contact. The commander does it. What? You better be back in a few She's minutes. Using to hide. Just the two of us now! Recon team. Doesn't it seem a little weird to you? There was a problem underground. We've got the temple covered too. I don't know, man. It still feels like we went from an amber alert in the known area to a red alert all over the place. We've been overreacting to things since that storm hit. What now? Checking now. Man down! here! Cover in blood! Jonah, Commander Rourke is here in Peru. He ordered Trinity to lock down a dig site below an old oil well. You going to check it out? Yeah, I'll see what they found. Rourke was there in Cozumel when Dominguez took the dagger. They must have figured out the next step to the hidden city. <laughs> All full up. Can't carry any more. There's been a bloodbath here. What happened? Jonah, I made it inside the temple. I think we found something here too. Some numbers. I'm gonna clear it off. The numbers on the pillars look like the first half of dates. Ishal on the left, Shakshal on the right.
to match the symbols. Another door. There must be more to this. to match the symbols. I have two dates here, and E-Shell. I think I've seen the date on the left somewhere. The photo from Cozumel. Maybe there's a clue. In the Maya long count calendar, all dates have five numbers. This numeral was damaged to look like a 13, but what if it's really an eight? That's a 2,000 year difference, and the constellations would be in a completely different position so the star path would lead west to somewhere in Peru. Photo from Cozumel. Maybe there's a clue. To find the hidden city, go south along the shore until you find the pink fish, then check
Okay, Jonah. What's the final number for Shack Shell? A line across with two dots on top of it. Seven, I think. Thanks. I found a mural. It seems to depict some kind of journey. Entering through a jaguar mouth follows a serpent toward a silver eye. Uh-huh. On the way, there's a spider and an eagle that rises toward a temple. Okay, I don't know about most of that, but the jaguar mouth is back this way. Really? Yeah. Cat sculpture, big teeth. Oh, here. He's back. Laura, you okay? Yeah, I'm heading back. Good. I think you're gonna like this. Hmm. Can't figure out the dialect. I must be missing something. Interesting.
Jesus. Don't do that. Sorry. Anybody else make it? Fuck the final. Base camp, this is Omicron team. We've been ambushed. Base camp, come in. Anything? Quiet. I need to hear. Base camp. Command, anyone? I still can't. Holy Christ. What are they so afraid of? I lost my radio in the crash. I saw him. Claws. Teeth. That's helpful. Hey, some consideration here. If they hit us. Just screaming. Bones. It's over. You're safe. We're dead. We're dead. You okay now? God. If those things are half as bad as he says they are. Everywhere. It's over. You're safe. We just need to wait it out until the reinforcements arrive. Mm, impossible. I can't carry any more. Seconds and we're in. Has to be a way out of here. Maybe in the direction they came from. Bodies everywhere. The creatures killed them. But why? Jonah, Abby. Hey, Laura? 
I saw something. Trinity is being hunted by some kind of creature. What? It made hissing sounds and moved so fast. Lara, that sounds like the legend of the Pistaco. You pulling our legs? No, I know what I saw. Are you safe? Yeah, I'm on my way back. I don't have enough space for that. I've got some stuff to trade if you're looking. Hi there. See anything that you like? I'm always ready to do business. Jonah? We're downstairs. Have you been down there? We were waiting for you. What do you think we'll find? The mural showed a series of trials. <laughs> I may know another way around. Okay, I'll go ahead and meet you on the other side.
Jonah, I've come out in some sort of cavern. There are signs that people have been here. Jonah? Incredible. Jonah, I'm at the next trial. The Eagle. It has something to do with the wind. I'm still tracking west. Heading downward now. There's an underground river. What's at the end of these trials? The hidden city, but... I can't carry any more. Standing after centuries of earthquakes and storms.
Might be a ladder if it was the right way up. Need to find where to start the machinery. Need to find where to start the machinery. I'm down. Deploy the banners. <laughs> this looks promising. Magnificent. Better get up higher.
was close. That'll hold. There. Good. The ladder should turn now. the machinery.
to face in a temple built in your honor. Should be able to make my way down to the chamber from here. Jonah, I'm past the Eagle Trial. I must be closing in on the Hidden City. Full up. Can't carry any more. The view up here is amazing. The hidden city must be near. Laura, I made it through. I'm entering a cavern. Jonah? Damn. to be more careful.
can't stay here. That was close. Right. Jonah, I may have found it. The hidden city. I'm gonna look for the serpent with a silver eye. All full up. Can't carry any more. Who are you? What's your purpose here? I'm a researcher, Lara Croft. They'll be back. We must find safety. Bring her. You're not only my son, you're my heir. You must not court unnecessary danger. Had you not been there, would this woman have found us? I'm glad you're safe. If you're not with the cult, how did you find this place? I followed a map from a temple. I was expecting ruins, not you or any of this. The cult. Why did they attack your son? I recognize their insignia. I know them as Trinity. I'm trying to stop them. 
Stop them from doing what? They're looking for an artifact. Uh, some sort of box connected to a moon goddess. Why do you want it? To steal it? Sell it. No. I just can't let Trinity, the cult, get to it first. They're too dangerous. Why? What have they done to you? They killed my father. Can I show you something? Do you know what this is? This is by Titi. You're already here. By Titi, the hidden city. But what's this eye? That is a place of death and sacrifice. And you think your artifact is there? Yes. No, none who has gone has ever returned. I'd be willing to try. You would risk it simply to stop the cult? Yes. Bring him in. Jonah. Are you okay? Do you know this man? He's my best friend. Abby. She's fine. Who else is looking for you? There's no one else. I believe we're seeking the same thing. We will bring you to the serpent with the silver eye, but we'll keep your friend here. You won't get very far if you're lying, and he will not be comfortable. You don't need to do that. It's, it's fine. I'll stay. Etsli, get this woman some clothes. Would you? Keep him company. I'll be back as soon as I can. All right. Pretty nice place. Quiet. I don't know your name. I apologize. As the rebel leader, I have to be careful. I am the rightful queen, Unuratu. Etsli, you still owe me a scouting report. Yes, mother. Uh, there was one thing this morning. Yes? I saw Hakan debating with his neighbor. He seemed angry. As I came near, they suddenly stopped talking. Then they started laughing as if one had told a joke. He's planning something. Good work. Thank you, Mother. Hey. Hi. As you can see, secrets don't stay secret for very long in Paititi. If you were to deviate from the plan, you'd find out quickly. I see that. She's here to help me find something I lost. You don't have to worry about that. Was father a scout when he was my age? He was a hunter. Was he ferocious? He could be, but he was also very kind. Look around if you Who wish. 
I will be in the market across the river when you're ready to find the box official. Careful, friend of Unuratu. The Jaguar warriors. Don't get too close to them. They are always watching for rep. This is a traditional foot plan. Do you believe that major events in life can be traced back to a single moment? I do. Take what's happening now. Had Amaru and Saidi not fought that day during the famine, and had Saidi not insisted, despite Amaru's wishes, that it should be him who would go beyond the safety of the borders to hunt for the village, Perhaps things would be different today. You see, Amaru felt responsible for his brother's death. I heard him the night they pulled Sairi's body from the wilderness. He was beside himself with grief. I think that was the moment. It broke Amaru. He took complete control of Paititi after that. He wanted to protect us all because he couldn't protect Sairi. What I saw, <sighs> he has Why? them. Enough, Taki. You Are you okay? No. Pisco the dead took my dice, and no one believes me. But he took them. A dead man took your dice. Are you sure you didn't lose them? Ugh, you're as bad as the rest of them. I'm sorry, you're right. I'll tell you what, I'll pay very close attention, and if I see Pisco the dead, I'll ask for your dice back. Really? You believe me? It won't be the first time the dead seem to speak to me. Beautiful. Bash? Will you trade? Please. I have barely made enough to offer in tribute. Tribute to who? The cult of Kukulkan, of course. They demand half of all profits earned on market day. But if they think I tried to short them... I understand. Thank you, Ishiki. Will you trade then? The gods favor us both. You have made an excellent choice, my friend. May the gods smile upon you. It's a bit humble. Are you Pisco the dead? You can see me? At last, Pisco is seen. Are you also dead, Ishiki? No. So you are Pisco the dead. I am Pisco, servant of the gods. I'm Lara. Lara. Nice name, Lara. You are not dead. Neither are you. Oh, but I am. 
As a child, I was to be sacrificed. I was brought to the mountain. The ritual was completed, but... But you survived. Only my body. I am dead to all my friends and family. I live by the offerings that are left for me. I met a boy who says Pisco stole his dice. Taki? He's the son of a very arrogant noble. He insisted we play a game. He lost. I don't have many things, but I won those dice fair and square. If you want, I'll play you for them. Do you want to play a game? What's the game? Talk to five people who have been cast out. Hear their wisdom and tell me why Taki lost, and I'll give you the dice. I can do that. Hello. Hello, Ishiki. It's rare to see outsiders in this city. Pisco sent me to speak with you. Ma, ah, Pisco. I like him. You've seen other outsiders? Only one. He was handsome, gentle, and kind. We were in love. But our love is forbidden. Outlawed by the cult of Kurkurkan. That's awful. I'm sorry. I was sentenced to death. Tied to the cliffs and left to die. On the third day, I welcomed death. That's when he found me. The outsider. He freed me and treated my wounds. Who was he? I don't know his name. It's been many years, but I still hope to see him again. I often return to the cliffs, near the condor nests, and collect their feathers. They remind me of him. That's a remarkable story. Thank you for trusting me with it. Thank you for listening, Ishiki. They said I'm a liar, and... Hello? Pisco sent me. Ah, did he? Did you say you were cast out for lying? No, Ishiki. I was cast out for telling the truth. That was my mistake. What happened? Should I say I've never seen an outsider? If no one believes the truth, it never happened. What outsiders? They dress in black and have strange weapons. They hide gold. I told the cult about the gold and the outsiders. They cast me out for lying. Lying? The gold was for them. One day, the cult will be exposed for its hypocrisy. So what do you do now? I lost everything, Ishiki. My position, power, reputation. But it took me losing all that to finally see. I had no purpose, no calling. And you found one? Yes. I serve the future by protecting the past. Queen Unuratu's line are the rightful rulers of Paititi, not the cult of Kukulkan. Everything I see, everything I hear, everything I know, now helps the rebellion. A worthy cause. I send people to steal the gold shipments the outsiders deliver from time to time. They never change the drop-off point. Sounds like you're making a difference in a lot of people's lives. Thank you for sharing. It was nice talking with you. You too, Ishiki. Now I serve Ishi- Hello. Are you one of the outcasts? Yes, Ishiki. I'm Chaska. I'm Lara. Pisco sent me. Pisco the dead? Sent you to me? Did you lose a game of Patoli? No. A boy Taki lost his dice. I'm trying to win them back for him. Pisco wanted me to talk to all those who've been cast out before he gives them back to me. I'm surprised he didn't try to play you for them. He is. Ah, well, all I can tell you is this. Like Pisco, I was cast out. I lost my job and my position. But not because of an accident, because of something I did and would do again. What happened? Do you have any children? No. Neither do I. I did not receive the blessing of Ishel. But for my mistress, I was the midwife for her three children. I loved them like they were my own, until I lost my position. What did you do? I'm a thief, Lara. What did you steal? A jade necklace. Why? The youngest, Kiara, she saw the necklace while visiting a friend. She took it. They were coming for her. They would have cast her out. She was an only child. I said I took it. My mistress took the necklace from me and threw it on the floor, breaking it. And cast me out instead. I'm so sorry. Don't be sad for me. I would do it again. 
Kiara's learned her lesson and she has a good life. As for me, I serve Ishel now through my weaving, the way my mother taught me. And my Kiara comes to visit me sometimes. Thank you for sharing that, Chaska. Kiara was lucky to have you. Be well, Ishiki. A white capybara. Posey blessing and a curse. Hello. Are you an outcast? Yes, Ishiki. Hello. I heard you talking about a white capybara. Oh, not just one. There are many of them. Pisco sent me to speak to all those who are cast out. You're a hunter. I am now. I was once a farmer, but that wasn't a life for me. I felt trapped. Forced to live up to the duties and expectations brought down by my family. I finally refused and went my own way. And a white capybara was responsible? No, Ishiki. I heard of them. One night they assaulted my field, trampled everything, but I did nothing to stop them. I just watched. They gave me an idea. A herd of this capybara, all white. What if I could hunt them? What if I could finally get away from the fields? So you did it. Best decision I ever made. My father disowned me, gave the farm to my sister, but that's fine with me. I'm a hunter now. They call me Paimo the White. <sighs> Thank you for the entertaining story, Paimo. Thank you, Ishiki. Come see what I have to trade. Hello. Hello. You're Lara, aren't you? Uh... Pisco sent you. He did. I'm Moreika. <laughs> that was the second time I heard your name today, Lara. The cultists are talking about you. You're the one who started the cleansing. The one who found the key of Shakshel. I am. Oh, don't feel bad, child. The cleansing was long overdue. It must be decided. Do we continue or begin again? That's not an easy decision. Did you hear that, Rimac? Deciding the fate of the world is not easy. <laughs> I like this one. You're right, Lara. It isn't. And if the cult of Kukulkan decides, they will enslave us all and call it protection. Won't they, Rimac? <laughs> he doesn't talk much. The cult is acting out of fear. Fear of what? Fear of the outside. Fear of change. But the same threats that are outside are in all of us. Fear is the enemy, not change. Change is the only constant. But look at me rambling on, Dreamac. The lady must want to buy something to help in her search. Pisco? You've already spoken to them, haven't you? I have. But you still don't see it. They all had hope. You need to do better than that if you want to win the game, Lara. Hope is one thing, but all those who have been cast out have thrived in their new lives despite their circumstances. Even you, Pisco. Well, I am the best Patoli player Paititi has ever known. <laughs> Not bad for a dead man. <laughs> Not bad at all. So again, what did you learn? I learned that sacrifice can make your life better. That you shouldn't be constrained by the legacy of your family. You can find your own path. Love is stronger than death, and you need to believe in something greater than yourself. But ultimately, you can't control everything. It's what you make of your situation that defines you. Well said, Lara. You're sure you're not dead? <laughs> Taki thinks he lost his dice because he was unlucky. But it's not the throw of the dice that wins the game. It's the skill of the player. I see that now. What did you think of Moreka, the outcast? She was expecting me. She seemed to know quite a bit about me. Ah, she knows a lot about everything, Ishiki. She has the most wondrous items in her shop. Artifacts known only to the gods. I saw. You were lucky you found her. She often travels outside of Paititi, gathering inventory. She seemed the most optimistic. Of course she is. We have a saying in Paititi. We all create destiny. We don't choose our circumstances, only our actions. A lesson my friend Taki needs to learn. Well played. Thank you, Pisco. I'll bring the dice back to Taki. I found your dice, Taki. Oh, thank you. 
Didn't you say Pisco stole your dice? Everyone knows Pisco steals. According to him, you wanted to play a game and you lost. He wouldn't let me play again. Just one more roll and I would have won. Pisco wanted you to know. It's not the throw of the dice that wins the game. It's the skill of the player. Now that I have my dice back, I can practice more. Thanks again, Ishiki. Hakan! What is this? Cultist, waiting for their deity to appear. When the catastrophes come, the god Kukulkan must be sacrificed to power the sun. Otherwise, the world dies. Sacrifice a god? The sacrifice is my duty. But this cult leader will take my place and attempt to become the god. He believes we can remake the world and live in a paradise of his design. Remake the world? What? I've heard those words before. There he is! I know him. That's Dr. Dominguez. Behold! The instrument of our unity and salvation! Soon, our dreams of peace and safety will be realized! They already call him Kukulkan, but his real name is Amaru. He was born here, but raised, lied to, by outsiders. The people believe in him. But you don't. My late husband, Saidi, was his brother. They had differences over the future of Paititi. When Saidi died, Amaru devoted himself to the cult. You have seen the storm. You are worried about worse to come. I ensure you that Paititi will persevere and thrive forever. I know him well. If Amaru is successful, all of us who disagree will never see this paradise. The rebels will be discarded. Not if they don't find the box. Yes. Our best hope is to find it first. Perhaps Amaru might still be brought to see love and reason. Death to the outsiders! Retribution will come! Hakan! Enough! We must strike while the snake is within reach. Justice will be met in good time. Do not jeopardize our rebellion for the sake of impulse. Scout ahead. We'll meet you at the edge of the mountain. Last warning. Go. Follow Esley. Your clothing won't hide you long from these guards. Okay, I'll find the box. You've been warned to keep the peace. I was just out for a pleasant stroll with my son. <laughs> Amar is losing his patience. It won't happen again. Jonah, can you answer? Yeah, me and Uchu set up camp. Everything's okay. Dominguez is here. He's the leader of the cult of Kukul Khan. That's what Unaratu's rebels are fighting. What? He's been here for years. Trinity controls Paititi. Whoa. I'm going to the Eye of the Serpent. We have to get the box before the next cataclysm hits. Second. Unuratu and her rebels are the true sons and daughters of Paititi, if you're asking. I'm not the only one who thinks it either. 
Just the only one with the guts to say it, apparently. The cleansing is upon us. And it should be Unuratu's line that sacrifices Kukulkan to restore the sun, and not the other way around. But thoughts like that have a way of getting people dead. So it's no wonder they aren't voiced. Where is my mother? She's settling matters between the guards and Hakan. What's it like outside by Didi? Well, a lot of things. It's a very big world. Bigger than Paititi? <laughs> Bigger than 100 Paititis. What? Will you take me there? I think your mother might have something to say about that. Hmm. What you're looking for is in there. How will I know when I found the right chamber? By the smell of death. If you survive, you can find your way back through the old irrigation system. I'll meet you there. Be careful. The cult often patrols there. Right. Full up. Can't carry any more. <laughs> I don't think anything could have prepared me for this place. The people, their history, everything they've lived and who they are today. To hear him tell it, Amaru, Dominguez, Kugel Khan, only wants to keep Paititi safe. But I've seen the lengths he'll go to, the murder and cruelty. I have to stop him. Through there. This must be the place Etsli mentioned. Steady, Laura, steady. Hmm. <laughs> 
I'm gonna be sick. Okay, take it slow. You can do this. I have no choice. Is this one of the rebels? A serpent with a silver eye. I'm on track. Yes, through there. Ugh, the smell keeps getting stronger. I found another serpent with a silver eye. I must be getting close. You? Talking tattoos with Uchu. Tattoos? Yeah, you saw Unuratu's, right? It has a heron and an eclipse on it. That might have something to do with the silver box. I don't think so. This is the only way, okay?
have to burn that barrier. All full up. Can't carry any more. Gotta be a way to burn away that barrier. <laughs> Full of oil and blood. Barriers down. Need to keep moving. <laughs> Is this some kind of bloodletting chamber? have taken hundreds of sacrifices to get enough blood to fill these channels. A barrier. Now, to find the silver box. This must be what Trinity is missing.
There's the little rebel prince. Esley! Over there! Get her! has something he wants to ask you. I think it's a favor. Okay, I'll make my way back as soon as I can. Unaratu must be worried about Etsley. I have to tell her he's been captured. Done. Unaratu! Etsley's been captured. I know. They're holding him at the barracks. We're working on a plan to release him. I tried to get him, I'm sorry. He's a warrior. What's that? Oh. This is a key. It looks like... It looks like it belonged to the mountain temple. It is adjacent to where they're holding him. Is the box of each shell connected to the barracks? Is that why the cult occupy the temple? It's heavily guarded. When we go in, it has to be subtle, silent. Is there a back way? The, there was one by the salt mine, but it has deteriorated. It's treacherous. I might be able to manage it. Perhaps. You did survive the sacrificial pit. I haven't been back inside since I was a child. But from what I can remember, the barracks are within an inner stronghold. If I can get in through the back way, I can clear a path and let you in. We will free Etsley, then go find the box. I'll take care of my son. You go after the box. Thank you. 